Hi, welcome to Engineering Made Easy. I am Lalit Vasist. Today we will uh, learn the Laplace transform of sin h80 and uh, cos h80. These are the hyperbolic functions. So, see it's, uh, let's see its derivation. Okay. Since uh, we know that uh, sin h80 is equal to e to the power 80 minus e to the power minus 80 divided by 2. We also know that the Laplace transform of e to the power 80 is 1 divided by s minus a. We have uh, seen it earlier. We have also derived it, the Laplace transform of e to the power 80. So we will use this. So the Laplace transform by linearity theorem, we know that if I want to calculate the Laplace transform of this sine at 80 then uh, we can write this Laplace transform of this as half this half is taken out and the Laplace transform of e to the power 80 this minus Laplace transform of e to the power minus 80 okay uh, I have just used the linearity theorem of Laplace transform and Laplace operator has been used with these two okay so it is written as half this half and the Laplace transform of e to the power 80 is by this formula 1 divided by s minus a this minus sign and then the Laplace transform of e to the power minus 80 is 1 divided by s plus a okay so this is simply by the formula now we will uh, solve this simple uh, mathematical function simple uh, mathematical operation this can be written as just take the lcm s plus a s minus a and just solve it so you will get this expression and after that just uh, cancel out these two okay and you will have uh, the laplace transform of sin h a t as uh, a divided by s square minus a square it's quite simple in the same way you can uh, find the expression for uh, the Laplace transform of cos h80 another hyperbolic function so how to do this we know that the cos h80 can be written as e to the power 80 plus e to the power minus 80 divided by 2 in uh, sin h80 it was just uh, minus sign here and everything is same okay so just take Laplace operator Let's take Laplace transform of both sides. So its Laplace transform would be just open this using the linearity theorem. So this will be distributed over this Laplace transform of e to the power 80 plus Laplace transform of e to the power minus 80 and this half is taken out. So just uh, we will use the formula of Laplace transform of e to the power 80 and e to the power minus 80 here and we will add it. Look at this here we have half and the Laplace transform of e to the power 80 was 1 by s minus a and that of uh, e to the power minus 80 is 1 by s plus a its LCM is s plus a into s minus a that is s square minus a square a plus b into a minus b form and simple mathematical operation and you will get ultimately this so this is nothing but the Laplace transform of cos h80 which is s divided by s square minus a square so hence we found the laplace transform of sin h80 and cos h80 i hope you liked it and for more updates please uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel engineering made easy and also for uh, more details you can uh, visit my blog also uh, www.engineeringmadeeasypro.com okay so you can find its link in the description of my video so you can check it thank you thanks for watching bye